How's it going, dudes? It is the Conversational Caveman, and last time we failed the wheel, so we're gonna move on to justice and see what this is all about. So, help defend the Imperial Fort against wave of Northerner attacks. Prepare for combat against Northerners, precision, and chance cards. So, we will. We'll take her. I like that idea. And let's grab some of these newer ones. Just because I don't know what exactly they do. Fight Northerners. Let's see. Hmm. Want to get that token. Hmm. We'll take that. Elder's Gift. Hmm. Stress damsel, empire contacts. Then well, let's jump to the end and get. I guess that card is one of your favorites. I don't see the appeal. Well, it's a darn shame now, isn't it? We'll be fighting northerners, so we want. Which one is it? That one. And then. I want to jump to the end and grab our gambler's jewel, our lord's whatever, diadem, diadem, let's grab the imperial armor, hmm, let's grab that one. That could be helpful. Let's grab a shield. We always need a shield. So let's go for this one. Let's check out what that does. And grab that. So we can see what that does as well. And for starting, we'll grab that. What do you do again? Oh. We'll find out, I guess. And let's start off with 10 gold. That sounds good. Okay, let's see what happens. The people in our lives have much to teach us. In your case, each one is a lesson to be learned. With their aid, you can discover the truth that lies at the center of this web. Oh, man. Allies and enemies, friends and foes. The Empire has been all of those things to you, yet ultimately... The Emperor lays dead by your hand. I wonder when we did that. The heroic Imperial General, Roldan the Fierce, has disappeared in the Northern Mountains during a diplomatic mission. A company has been sent to search for Roldan and his entourage. You have been enlisted as a scout for the group, given your experience with dealing with the Northerners. You head off to catch up to the reinforcements who have established a small camp just outside of Empire territory. Oh. Are those impassable? You are brought to the commander of the fort, Salius Calus Pompeius? Calus Pompeius Tranico? His large bulk is ill at ease with a thin mountain air and he pauses only briefly to address you. Mercenary, we need supplies of wood and stone. Go out and find what you can for us. I'm not taking another step in these dreadful mountains until we've established a proper defense. The commander roars to his lieutenant, lieutenant as he hurries back to his tent. Roldan's recklessness led to his downfall, and I'll not repeat his mistake. A squad of soldiers makes ready to accompany you into the wilderness. The men are led by Captain Alpus, who seems far too young for his gloomy con continents. I hope you know your way around these mountains, he mutters as you leave the fort together. Yeah. You set off into the mountains once more. Cool. 
Let's check this out. The study of wood is the study of steel. For without the ability to cut, our tools are nothing. The ancient path up the mountain leads through light woodlands. Hundred wood remains at this location to be harvested. Let's harvest. Your supplies are running low. Make your choices carefully. Silver wouldn't be bad, but we want as much as possible. The soldiers quickly and efficiently hack down a number of trees before you continue on. Awesome. You pass a messenger on the road who gives warning of northerner raiding parties in the area. They may already know that we are here, Captain Alphys warns. We should try to avoid facing them directly while we establish our defenses. Okay. We can do that. General store. Let's buy some food. That should work. And leave. Because that way... Yeah, we can return back here and try again. Nice. The pendulum is ever changing. I think we just got and the, the rest challenges of the woods it presents change too. Yeah. Nice. The old maiden. Um. Let's ask for supplies. We need some. Wow, that was a good one. Mountains. The mountains are too perilous for you to pass. But I'm pretty sure that's the only way you get stone. These tokens represent the expansion the of the game. More options, more Let's cards, gold. more opportunities. Let's not go for gold. Let's go for blue, sure. Here we see yet another wheel. Each different, yet each bearing yeah. their own similarities. Now let's hope we get the last one and we good. We might even get the token, which would be awesome. Oh yeah, just barely, just barely. That's awesome. As you add the blue mushrooms, a mixture glows in intense blue, lighting up the room. You did it! The alchemist's eyes glow, grow wide with excitement. The elixir of kings. He dips a large ladle into the glowing broth. Here, drink it. It will bring you luck. Oh, nice. The liquid is surprisingly cold, considering it was boiling just moments ago. It takes your breath away as it runs down your throat, energizing your body to the tips of your fingers and toes. Your mind clears, and you find a newfound resolve for the mission at hand. The alchemist thanks you profusely for your assistance before returning to his ledger, mumbling to himself, The elixir of life still eludes me. What color could it be? Ah! Okay, so we gotta get red to get that token. That's too bad. We pass through the rivers and hope to be washed clean. Yet here we are. You struggle to the other side of the river. That's it? We definitely don't want to run into him. We might have just screwed ourselves. I don't know. We'll see. This is a force too large for you to handle on your own. Hmm. Let them pass. Trouble approaches, Estrella calls out, trotting back to you and the troops. We're seriously outnumbered. Luckily, though, we have some options for avoiding the brutes. Attempt to hide, attempt to hide. Um. Near my cave, sure. Perfect. Nice and easy. Okay. Let's see what you do with that, given your position. Another mountain river. I want to get onto the mountain. Magician still operating in these lands. A brave decision, and one I hope keeps him in good health. You enter the workshop of the enchanter. He specializes in adding magical powers to items, especially those that bring health and fortune to adventurers. I can enchant one of your items. Be warned. Any exist existing enchantment will be destroyed. The enchanter states that he has nothing suitable for you at the time. That sucks. Okay, fine, whatever. Old and woods sweets. and old secrets dwell here. Let's gather some wood. Oh man. Ooh. Ooh sure. Oh, look at that. Breathe, you have done well. 
That was awesome. We're gonna go back. So we don't the game avoid is that a guy. Bridge between this world and the We've next. Done this one, I'm reaching sure. forward into the nothing beyond. What? You stand at the edge of the ravine. A river find when winds it there. Winds between the rocks far below. The air is thin here. Okay, well, that kind of... Uh... Yeah, let's collect some more gold. Where? Wood, I guess. Oh my gosh. I don't think that should have worked that way. <laughs> but I don't know. Get, I'm glad it did, though. We avoid again. Take a higher, narrow path. Trail. You and your imperial allies carefully pick your way th along the winding trail. You hide behind a rock as the raiders follow the path underneath, and then continue through the mountains undetected. Kneeling in a place like this always carries a price. Um, I don't know. Yeah, we have no money. You received news of a northerner raid on the Imperial Fort. 65 soldiers were lost, 915 soldiers remain. Interesting. Let's try it. Let's see what happens. Back to the bones. Oh, I perfect. hope you have learned to be their master. Awesome. Thank you, the woman says. We get food, right? Yeah, very helpful. Nice. Oh. Um. I like that. Bring the battle to oh. their door. Yeah, no, not yet. Does this one have any more wood? Guess it does. Let's do it. That's fine. We'll take silver. Could be worse. That will set you in good stead from here. We only missed out on one wood, or ten wood. We're gonna have to make our way around this guy. Which is fine, theoretically. Oh, this one's a little bit more evened out. Ah, oh, shit. Does that mean we have to fight him? Because we'll fight him. You and your Perhaps imperial you allies head into time. the darkness of the cave. At the last moment, you realize that the trailing soldiers have failed to hide their tracks. Ow! That's barely anybody. We got this. That can't be too tough. Especially with Hretha's ire. I don't know if that was would have hurt me, but I don't see if it would have hurt Gain four fame, zero empire soldiers lost in combat. Yes, nine northerners killed. Awesome. Oof. Bad roll. Ice. Just barely, but well still. Well done. You continue to impress. Commander Treminko makes a cur cursory inspection of the wagon of wood on your return. Good work, men. You commend he commends the troops who accompanied you before quickly retreating to his tent. His lieutenant remarks, keep searching the hills. 
We will need stone as well. You may visit the mess, the mess tent for supplies, so long as you remain useful. Uh, thinking we're gonna go with the gambling's jewel. Um, we're gonna gather. Friends in high places will take you far these days. We shall fight the northerners. Oh, yes. Oh, but we can't buy it. That's too bad. That's too bad. But whatever. I lost 70. That's not good. Mountain River. And Temple Pre- Ah, oh, I don't even have gold. I don't have anything. Stone <laughs> will be key to your success. Yeah, we will get. Ooh. Could have been worse. Twenty-six stone. Nice. We're gonna do it again. Nice. One more time. For good measure. I know we're blowing through food, but... Heck yeah. Okay. Now we turn back. Should only let him move once. Which means I'll be standing on there by the time he attacks. Um, visit the mess tent? You enter a tent filled with the unpleasant aroma of hardy soldiers and unidentifiable food. While securing supplies for your next tri trek into the wilderness, you overhear soldiers talking. I heard the northerners can move through th these hills like ghosts in the wind. They come out of nowhere to kill and then vanish again. So inspect the fences. You find Captain Alpus overlooking the digging of a ditch around the outskirts of the camp. Commander Tremenko has ordered us to fortify this base camp before he sends us into the mountains to fight world, world on. At least we might last a little longer here than exposed on the mountain trails. He considers darkly gazing up in the mountains. Let me show you what we have planned, he says, turning back to the task at hand. Um, let's do a central tower. Inspect fences. Wait. Interesting. Can you hold against such savages? And for how long? I don't know, we'll see. We'll see how long we can last against these savages. This is an interesting map. I'm not used to these uh, objective-based missions. I like it. Oh, why didn't I? Oh, I'm not worried. Soldiers in my way. Oh. <laughs> I have too much help. Now, how are we gonna get more stone? 70, not, 79 soldiers were killed? Are you kidding me? Out? I call bull. I wanna see. Damn, that is weird. Let's go back to that quarry. I think that's our best bet for stone. All 
Right.